<laughs> 10 out of 10. This is to me like the definition of a cult classic horror. This was a Roger Corman picture. I, I don't I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know if I want less rape or more rape. I'm assuming less. If you work for Roger Corman or Canon Films or any of these places, you do as you're told because you're going to get a director's credit. Composer James Horner, who composed the music for this movie. I did a double take when I saw that. I'm just saying a lot of things exploded in this movie that should not have exploded. There's no gas in the wind. Oh, oh, when I get home, I'm going to shake the shit out of you. Peggy Larson is the gorgeous. Well, she's the blonde. Then at the wood paneled social hall, you know, good old social hall back in the day. You know, we don't have enough of those, right? I couldn't tell you where a social hall is to save my life. Have you ever seen tits before? Come here. No, I'm a ventriloquist. The climax of this movie is at the No Yo Salmon Festival. Rob Bottin did the effects, the creature effects. And then wasn't it that he only had one full costume? So they had one full functioning costume and... Like two half costumes, I think? It works! They're like, look, guys, it's either going to be natives or a little bit more special effects. We can't afford both. 